uh, we are Steve right down the road here from Radio City Music Hall at the NHL team headquarters. You can see the assembled media gives you an idea just how big this meeting is for the city of Seattle, Seattle Mayor Jenny Durkin and the group that is trying to bring a professional hockey franchise to Seattle. We've seen some of the owners go in for this meeting, Todd Lywicki, Tim Lywicki as well, and Seattle Mayor Jenny Durkin. She stopped to talk to us about what she expects this morning. Hey guys. What's going on? We're going to go get a hockey team. Simple thing. All we have to do is sell Seattle, right? And how do you do that? We do that. The fans do it. It's all about the fans in Seattle. We already showed by the way we sold out the tickets. But these are businessmen who are looking at how this franchise is going to affect the hockey across the country and in Canada. We got to show them that hockey in Seattle is good for everybody, and I think we can do it. I think I want to stress number one: Seattle's a place you want to have hockey, and if you have hockey in Seattle, everybody's going to do better. Um, I also want all the fans to know we're going to do our best to get there. We've got a great team with us, um, and I think that they've shown a commitment to Seattle. We're going to have the best arena in all of the West Coast. Period. Durkin is speaking directly with what is called the NHL's executive committee, 10 high profile owners. We saw one of them who is the most powerful owner in the National Hockey League, Jeremy Jacobs of the Boston Bruins. He went in to this meeting. We're expecting it to last about an hour and a half. The Seattle group will give their presentation and then those owners will go to another hotel here in Midtown Manhattan where they will give a report to the entire ownership, all 31 owners in the NHL, and then start talking about the timeline and when and if they will award an expansion franchise to Seattle. So it is a big day here in Midtown Manhattan. We'll have you covered throughout the morning, throughout the day on King5 and King5.com. But for now, live in Midtown Manhattan, I'm Chris Daniels, King5 News.